Hey, what's up you guys? So it's about 9.30 a.m. I just woke up and it is raining outside, so it looks like I'll be spending the day editing. And I just kind of wanted to show you guys what I do on my rainy days and I guess kind of how I take care of myself out here and make sure I'm staying healthy and practicing self-care. If you ever wondered what it's like spending your days getting ready in a hostel, this is my morning routine. And also what I do on my off days. <laughs> so I know you guys probably thought I brought way too many cosmetics, but I actually do use most of this stuff every day for my daily routine. All right, so I start by using this Watercolors Intense Shampoo that was given to me by the awesome lady who colored my hair. And I make sure to rinse it in cold water, wait till it's damp, brush it out, and then use this Keratine Complex Infusion Gel to keep my hair nice and healthy. Step two is we're gonna use our Garnier Skin Active Cream. It's kind of like a face peeling mask. So you wanna make sure you get your face wet first and then rub it in a circular motion all over your face until it's completely covered. Once you finish that, you're gonna leave it on for five minutes before you go and wash it off. After I make sure it's all off my face, I put on my Nivea Soft Lotion, my personal favorite. It smells so good. So I put it all over my face, my arms, and my chest. Next, I use Organic Activated Charcoal Teeth Whitening Powder. And basically, you just put it on a bamboo toothbrush, not the toothbrush that you like brush your teeth with normally, Dip it in the powder and brush your teeth with it for two minutes. Makes your teeth all nice and black and shiny. And then after that, you brush your teeth regularly, followed by flossing and mouthwash, obviously. Dental care is super important when you're away from your dentist for six months. So after that, I put on my simple daily makeup. Even if I don't plan on going out for the day, I like doing my makeup just because it's something that makes me feel good about myself. And that's a big part of self-care because just doing little things that will make you happy will set your tone for the rest of the day. So I personally like to wear makeup. It's something I can have fun with. Then I take down my hair from my bun, brush out the rest of my hair. Oh, and can't forget to apply lipstick just because I bought new lipstick and I think it looks cute. So that's basically my getting ready routine. And I will follow that with some stretching, especially if I'm going to be spending a lot of my day at the computer. It's important not to sit for too long at a time. So I usually hold each one of these stretches for about three minutes and it loosens me up and I am ready to get to editing. It's also good for a little bit of me time where I can just clear my mind. So after that, the hair goes up because on the days that I spend just editing, I can't just sit still for the entire day. That would drive me crazy. So I incorporate it with a little bit of a workout. If you know anything about editing, you know that you have to render pretty much very often so you can continue to work with your footage. And I work with a lot of 4K footage, so I have to render it before I can edit it, otherwise it just won't cooperate correctly. So every time I hit that render button, I do some type of workout, whether it be squats or lunges or crunches or more stretching or just something to occupy the time so I'm not sitting here and staring at my computer while it's rendering. It's really easy to forget important things that you should be doing during your day while you're backpacking, like simply working out. So even if it's just a little bit every day, I like to make sure I incorporate that in there somewhere. How else am I gonna be carrying this 40 pound backpack around, right? I won't do it for every single render, like if the render's only like five to 10 seconds, but anything over a minute, gotta get to working out. And it makes me feel a lot more productive with my day. All right guys, so I hope you enjoyed learning about my daily routine slash rainy day routine, but actually the sun came out, so I'm gonna take advantage of this beautiful day and head outside. I will catch y'all in the next one.